Well, not quite sure how this will come out. Maybe a little bit dark. I'm hunkered down on uh, Friday evening, July the 19th. It's my first night of uh, intrepid weather. Got pretty wet today. It rained uh, for a couple hours straight as I was coming off uh, a mountain called Little Boardman. And I'm camped right now at about 2,400 feet up a 3,600 foot mountain. Tallest mountain in the 100 mile wilderness called White Cap. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to summit it and then uh, the next day start the Chairback Range, which supposedly are the toughest mountains in the wilderness, to, uh, to finish it off. And hopefully I'll be out at Monson, Maine on Tuesday. Um, giving a good test to the uh, Wilderness Logics Tadpole Tarp. Um, I'm relaxing right now in my butt in the sling, bias weight weenie, and uh, been getting great use out of the uh, Nano Buginator that the guys at uh, at Bias um, sponsored for this trip. And uh, Shane, Brian, I want to thank you for that. I'll do a review later on, but uh, so far everything's holding up great. Got a little bit damp because uh, I had it up in porch mode, the tarp, and it was blowing pretty good. Right now I'm having the experience of uh, laying in a hammock whose trees are uh, bending back and forth and uh, swaying the whole thing, the tarp too. I'm looking up at the top of these trees and they are just blowing up a storm, so to speak. And it's really interesting to think of the wind and how powerful it is up there. Um, 100 feet high, but down here it's relatively calm. Um, I'm kind of tucked up against the side of the mountain and that wind's coming in from the west. So, an interesting night. I won't say it's not a little nerve-wracking, um, but it's what I came out here for. Other than that, it's been six days of, of, uh, of dry and mostly sunshine, pretty hot leading up to today, so we were due for some rain. Supposed to get more of the same tomorrow and then uh, get clear and cooler. Um, drop down into the highs in the 70s and lows around 50 for uh, the last couple of days in the wilderness. Been talking to a lot of people about Lyme disease. Um, a lot of people noticed my lime green t shirt, my bandana, and some of the buttons I've got attached to my pack and my hat. And they've had some great conversations. Um, told some people some things they didn't know about Lyme disease and uh, and everybody's been really supportive. Um, haven't seen a tick yet and uh, I'm thrilled about that. So far Maine is uh, tick free as far as those crawling on me. But uh, we'll keep you posted as we get further on down into uh, the hot zones down around New York and New Jersey. And I have talked to about three different through hikers that were coming north that did catch Lyme disease in Pennsylvania. So apparently that's a pretty bad area, but uh, the docs they saw did the right thing and treated them right off the bat and they all, all got better. So more soon, um, uh, assuming that I don't get blown off the side of this mountain. Thanks for all the love and support and uh, I'll report back again later.